main threat will be some damaging wind gusts, possibly around 60, 65, 70 miles per hour. So that is our biggest concern, but there's still at least a low risk for a brief tornado and maybe a little hail, a few heavy downpours that could lead to some flood advisories or flood warnings. So a lot to talk about. We've got a strong cold front rolling in and look at this line of storms trying to pop right ahead of this front around 9, 10 o'clock, likely right over Cleveland around 10 p.m. That could impact some of your plans for this evening, so make sure you are prepared. If you were planning to be outside, you don't have to cancel your plans, but make sure you are able to get inside to a sturdy building quickly if you do go under a warning. I think by 11 p.m. midnight, the storms are progressing to the south and east, likely down around Akron, Canton, New Philly, Youngstown. I think after midnight, the severe threat will start to go down, but a few showers and rumbles of thunder may linger through about 7, 8 a.m. on your Monday. But I think after that, we are drying out and definitely cooling off. Look at this, highs in the 70s for your Monday instead of the hot and steamy weather that we dealt with for today. Temps near 90 and tons of humidity. So we erase a lot of that for your Monday and Tuesday as well. But rain chances are very high for tonight. 90% shot, 50% chance for rain early Monday. Then we're drying things out.